The horse farm is part of animal science, and animal science uh, takes a lot of pride in all of its different farms. We have farms for lots of different species, and they're all teaching farms. Their purpose here is to allow our animal science students some hands-on activities and to build skills to go with the lectures that we're teaching the students so that they have some some practical skills, some real world skills to go with the academic knowledge that they're getting in their more traditional classes. So the horse farm hosts um, thousands of students in a year and teaches some very specific equine courses to give the students that extra training in handling mares and babies, uh, being around stallions, this, their medical and health care, all the things that go into production and management of horses and that way our students when they're looking for jobs are a little more prepared for, for an internship or for a hands-on job in the industry if that's what they're looking for or a lot of our students are interested in going on to become veterinarians. My passion for horses started when I was 18 months old is the first time I got on a horse. Uh, my aunt has always had horses and so I grew up uh, going to her farm and riding horses whenever I could. And so that's just grown and continued and I always knew I wanted to do something with them. So when I found out about the awesome programs we have here, it was a no brainer for me to apply. And I think the thing I enjoy most is getting to be a part of reproduction and foaling. So all the new babies, when we start that here in February and start having foals on the ground is always awesome. And then like the rebreeding process is also a lot of fun. And just like all the different horses we get here since we have a lot of client horses come in. And I think last year we had like 80 foals. So it's just a lot of fun getting to play with them and give them butt scratches because they like that a lot. <laughs> keeping them healthy is keeping their environment clean. And so we do do quite a bit of just labor in terms of cleaning and taking care of the facilities too. Iowa State has some quarter horses and then they also have some thoroughbred horses. Um, the university, depending on the time of year, owns a, like between 40 and 60 horses. As those horses grow, they grow, go through a couple of our different animal science courses as the model for teaching. And then we do sell those horses and some of them go into show homes where they are going to go be ridden and compete in a variety of, of events and others go on to become racehorses or racehorse prospects and so um, they might see them someplace like Prairie Meadows if they wanted to go uh, on a family outing to see the races there. People enjoy horses and they represent freedom and athleticism and just a lot of things that are admirable uh, from, from our perspective and they're right here in the middle of town, right on campus, so they're easy to access and being able to get up close to them is something that the public really enjoys and we do certainly have a lot of visitors at the farm. So I have friends that walk by all the time and they're like, oh my gosh, I got to see the horses playing or I got to see the foals running around and I think it's just especially since ISU is an ag-based college but not everyone that goes to ISU is an ag or knows about animals or gets to see that so the cool part of like us being basically on campus is that people that walk by are in a design major a human sciences major and so they get to see livestock on a like daily basis and get to see these awesome majestic animals. 